Hello, everybody, and welcome to our Gold Lactation Online Conf for 2014. I'm Fiona Lang Sharp, IBCLC, and Public Relations Coordinator for Gold Conferences. We're going to be listening to Bobby Gehari at our conference, and he's going to be speaking to us was about diagnosis, diagnosis and management of tongue tie and lip tie in breastfeeding. Welcome, Bobby. It's great to have you here. Great. Thanks for having me. So I just have a few questions for you about what you do and, um, and how it has uh, impacted you. So let me start at the top here. How did you first become involved with uh, the tongue tie um, type of work that you do? Well, ironically, the whole reason I got involved was because it impacted my own family. Uh, I have two children. Uh, my older daughter had severe problems breastfeeding, and really we never found out why. Uh, and then we had a home birth um, several years ago, and our midwives suspected some problems with breastfeeding after seeing my wife breastfeed, and we were lucky enough to see uh, Melissa Cole, who's our lactation consultant, who identified a posterior tongue tie and lip tie on my youngest daughter, and she had that procedure uh, at seven days of age, and I was astounded by how different breastfeeding was for my wife, so it spurred my interest on how to determine more what was going on. Well, that's incredible because it's such a, now this is a real personal story for you in terms of, uh, you know, crossing over into your work. So tell me, what can our healthcare professionals, um, what can they learn from your talk? Well, I mean, the main thing that I try to try to speak on is that this is a real phenomenon. I think a lot of people out there think this is some fad or some new diagnosis. And what I have found in, in working with other professionals around the world is that uh, many of the breastfeeding failures and problems that are associated with uh, difficult relationships between moms and babies may actually be explained by what I'm going to talk about today. And also that there's really no difference between a laser procedure or a scissor procedure that as long as the anatomy that's in the way is dealt with, uh, we can make a huge impact on how babies uh, nurse. Well, that sounds very exciting. I'm, I'm really interested to hear um, what you have to say about the types of treatments um, and, uh, and many of the other things in you know, how we're looking at tongue tie today, as, especially for most of us as lactation consultants. No, it's very real, but how we communicate that into our communities. So I appreciate I'm I'm really looking forward to hearing what you have to say. So what are some of the outcomes um, you have seen personally um, from your point of view in treating um, and diagnosing and treating the, the tongue tie? Well, I think the most common one is uh, when mom is having significant pain at the breast and we can make some pretty dramatic impact um, when, when we have tongue tie and lip tie as a cause. The other uh, other things I've noticed on a lot of children have problems with reflux and obviously it's a very common diagnosis in children but babies who have an inefficient latch because they're sucking in air from an incomplete seal a lot of times I can make that go away with a procedure and then the other main focuses we look on are how quickly babies can you know breastfeed in terms of milk transfer and weight gain and, and overall just a quality of life difference from before and after and these are all things that eventually we'll hopefully look like look for in a clinical study coming up sometime in the future well thank you Bobby I really appreciate that yes there are so many things that we all know about um, that we can be supportive with the pain of the breath and you know reflux so many things that are constantly either underdiagnosed or in the case of reflux overdiagnosed that can be in relation to a tongue tie um, so I'll be interested to hear what you have to say about how we can organize this better so we can get better diagnosis as well well thank you everybody for listening this has been Fiona Lang Sharp uh, speaking with Dr. Bobby Gehari, who is going to be speaking at our conference uh, talking about diagnosis and management of tongue tie and lip tie in the breastfeeding baby. Thank you again. Bye-bye. <laughs>